Hello everyone. In this video, we will understand how to set up Maven software in Windows machine. Alright, let's get started. Here, we are going to set up Maven by following these 10 steps. First, we are going to download and install Java software because Maven software developed by using Java. So, Java is required to run Maven in our machine. Once Java is downloaded and installed, then we need to set up Java home in the environment variable. Then we need to set path for Java. Then we will verify Java installation is working successfully or not. Once Java setup is done, then we will download Maven software from Apache website. Maven we will download as a zip file. We will extract that zip file. Then we will set Maven home in the environment variable. Then we need to set Maven path. Then we will verify Maven setup is working or not. If it is working, then we will create one Maven project and we will build that project by using Maven goals. Alright, if you are new to our channel, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. Let's start. Download Java 70. Here we are getting Oracle website. Click on this first link Java SE 17 downloads. Here you can see Java 17 download file is available for. Windows. I'm downloading this last link, which is MSI, or you can download this .exe also. Anything is fine. I'm downloading this one. Click on this link. That file is getting downloaded here. You can go to Downloads, and you can see the file which got downloaded. Now, if you see in the Downloads just now, this Java 17 MSI file got downloaded. So to install this Java software, just we need to double click on this file. Next, next, and finish. It is preparing to install. Click on next. It is installing by default in the C program files Java JDK 17. Next. It is installing now. Yep. Installation got completed. Click on close. With this Java installation got completed, we can verify in the C program files Java JDK 17 got installed just now. We need to set up Java home. To set up this Java home, copy this JDK path. So in which location our JDK 17 is installed, copy that path. Then go to system environment variables. Search for edit system environment variables. Click on this. Here you can see environment variables option. Click on this button. Here user variables available, system variables available. User variables nothing but for currently logged in user, system variables applicable for all the users available in the machine. Let's go for system variables now. Click on new. Enter the variable name as java underscore home. It is predefined variable name. Variable value we just copied. C program for Java JDK 17. Remember, Java home will set up to JDK 17. Click on OK. Now we need to set the Java path. Right? Here, path is already available in our machine. So simply click on edit. And here, we need to check whether path is already available or not. Path is not available. You can select new here and enter up to bin directory. So if you see, inside the JDK bin directory will be available. Path we need to set up to bin directory. Click on OK and click on OK. So with this, our Java setup is complete. How to verify Java is working or not? Open command prompt in our system and verify Java installation. For this, simply type Java iPhone version. Yes, it is showing Java version 17 installed in our machine. With this, Java software is working as expected. Now, let's go for Maven setup. Download the Maven software. For that, we will go for Apache website. So download Apache Maven, go to official website of the Maven. Here you can see download option, Maven files available to download. Here we have tar file and the zip file. I'm downloading Apache Maven 3.94 zip file. Click on this link. That file will be downloaded. Now go to our downloads folder. Now you can see Apache Maven zip file got downloaded. Just extract that zip file. Extract to Apache Maven, right? Extracted. Inside this folder, one more folder is available. 
Apache Maven 3.9.4. Inside that you can see the folder structure is available. You can keep this folder here or you can keep in the C directory. I'm taking this folder from here. I'm going to my C drive. I'm keeping this folder here. Yes, this step is optional guys. Keeping in the C directory. Apache Maven available. Bin directory, boot, conflict. The file system is available. Take this Apache Maven. Now we need to set Maven home. In the same way, go to system variables. Here, click on environment variables. Earlier we set Java home. Now we need to set Maven home. Click on new. Variable name, type as Maven underscore home. Variable value, we copy it. Where our Apache Maven is available. Remember, I am not using bin here. For the home, bin is not required. Then next, path for the Maven. Go to path. Click on edit. Now earlier we had JDK path. Now add the Maven path. Path we need to set up to bin directory. Good. This is the Java path. This is Maven path. Click on OK. Click on OK. Fine. Now again, open the CMD and verify Maven setup is working as expected or not. MVN hyphen V. Yes, you can see Apache Maven 3.94 version is coming. So this Maven is working based on our Java version 17. So to set up Maven, first we need to set up Java. All right. With this, we are able to set up Maven. Now let us create one project by using Maven. I'm creating one simple standalone project by using Maven. This is the command we are using to create standalone project. Click on enter. Yes, build success. That means our project got created. So by default, our project will be created in this directory, users Ashok directory. Let's go into the project. I have given the name as 01 Maven app. I am able to navigate to the directory. You can say check that in the C users Ashok, our project got created, which is 01 Maven app. Let me show you. Yes, this is our 01 Maven app which is created. It contains the pom.xml. Now, in order to build this project, we can execute MVN clean package. Clean package goals I'm executing to build our Maven application. As it is a standalone application, this project will be packaged as a jar file. Now you can see the project packaged as jar file. Build got success. Go to the project, go to the target. Earlier, this target directory not available. Now we got the target directory and it contains the jar file. With this, we are able to package our project by using Maven. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.